This is the virtual machine that I want to clone, send OS 8 to 3D2. Okay, this is the name of the virtual machine. Click here. If the virtual machine is power on, please shut down the virtual machine. Once the virtual machine is power off, go to hard disk and verify the virtual hard disk. Is, is this file sent all 8.232 with the extension BMDK? But it's placed it on a directory. The directory is sent OS 8.232. And also place it on the data store one. Remember this. So click here and go to data store browser. Then identify the directory is this sent OS 8.232. So you need to create a new directory for the new virtual machine. Now create a directory. And this new virtual machine will have a different directory. Send OS 8, for example, to 34. Create, create directory. And is this the new directory? 234. Enter to original directory 232 and you have uh, the virtual hard disk is this with the BMDK extension and the BMX file. This file stores settings for a virtual machine created with a new virtual machine wizard, includes the memory, hard disk and processor limit settings enables a virtual machine to be started in the software. First of all, uh, select the virtual hard disk and copy, and the destination is the new directory 234. Now, this is the directory, the destination, then copy. And down and on background, you can see the process running uh, about 15% and wait for 100%. Completed successfully. Now, uh, on the original directory 232, select the BMX file. Select the BMX file. Co also copy this to the new directory 234. Copy. Completed, su completed successfully. Now verify the contents of the new directory 234. Now you have the copy of the two files. And select the BNX file and right click and register virtual machine. And on the background, you will see successfully register it. Then close this. Go to virtual machines. Now you will see. Uh, two virtual machines with the same name. Verify what is the original and what is the clone. Click here, go to hard disk. This is the directory, send OS 8.232. So this is the original. Go back to virtual machines and click here on the another virtual machine. Go to hard disk and verify the directory send OS 8.234. So this is the new cloned virtual machine. And you can edit this virtual machine 
go to via virtual machine options and change the name, for example, to 34. Then save this. And also, you can uh, edit this and verify that the all hardware options are the same like the original virtual machine. Okay, save. Now go to virtual machines and now you will see the two virtual machines with different names. Access to the new virtual machine, then power on. This virtual machine may have been moved or copied. VMware ESXi needs to know if this virtual machine was moved or copied. Okay, the answer is I copied it. Answer. And it doesn't matter what operating system are you using. Now you need to change the host name on this new virtual machine and also modify the IP configurations of this new virtual machine. In my case, I'm using CentOS 8 and I will proceed to modify the host name and IP configurations. For example, uh, username, password, um, super user to privilege access, the root password, and modify the host name, hostname CDL, set dash hostname, and this is the this is the current host name SRB CEN232. I will use a different uh, host name SRB CEN234. Now uh, modify the IP configurations and MCLI and verify the devices. Net network Manager CLI device. Um, my, my interface is ENS33, is an Ethernet interface. Uh, verify the configurations. Device. Uh, Show ENS33. Now uh, you have uh, IPv4 and IPv6 configurations. So modify IPv4 and IPv6 configurations.
Doesn't matter what operating system are you using, once the hostname and IP configurations were changed, you need to reboot this operating system. And I will choose the command to reboot this operating system. Now verify the new hostname SRBCEN234, the new hostname, username, and passwords. And verify the connection to internet, for example, ping uh, with IPv4 to google.com, for example, and control C to stop and ping using IPv6. Mm, very nice. So all is working very well. Thank you.